Hello, I'm Robin Fike at Stamping Country. Today I'm going to show you how to use your Simply Scored scoring tool to make the medallions, or sometimes they're known as lollies. Today we're going to make a smaller one that I'm going to use on a card, but you could adjust your measurements and make larger ones for bigger projects. So let's get started. For today's medallion project, I'm going to use two strips of designer paper. This is pink pirouette. It's 1 by 12 inches. If you want a bigger medallion, you're going to want to go a little wider than the 1, but you want to put it up in the corner. And then I'm going to score, score at the half inch, the 1 inch, the 1 and a half, the 2, and I will keep going. I'm going to do it at half inch intervals. So we'll do the hole and the half and the hole and the half. We're going to go all the way down on both strips of designer paper. To make this easier to fold when we're doing the medallion then we're going to turn it over to the opposite side so you can see where I have already scored and we're going to actually score again only this time we're going to score on the quarter so we're going to score at a, a quarter three quarters, one and a quarter, one and three quarters, two and a quarter, two and three quarters, and we're going to do that all the way down on both strips so that it's, it's sort of the in-between spaces of where we scored on the other side of the designer paper. So Once you have both strips uh, scored on both sides, you want to begin scoring them in accordion style. So you're just going to fold and, and you're just going to keep doing that, the right, the left. And you'll see how that by scoring on them on opposite sides, that makes that very easy to do. And every once in a while, you're going to want to pinch those so that your accordion's nice and tight. Once you have both accordions folded and just pinch them tight so they're nice and tight accordions, and you're going to want to put sticky strip on both ends of one of your accordions. Apply the ends of your accordion so that you have a long strip. You can pinch that so it's nice and shut. And you're going to wrap that around so that it forms a circle and adhere the other two sides, or the other side. And you'll have a nice circle there. It sort of looks like a cupcake wrapper without the bottom. Next, you're going to want to adhere it to something. I have a one and three quarter inch circle because I've only used the one inch strips. If you use a wider strip, you're going to want to use maybe a bigger circle. And I start by adding just a bit of hot glue. You want to have your gun already hot so that it's ready. And you're going to flip this around so that it begins making a circle, only you want it to go all the way in and make a very tight circle so that it's connected. Once you have it shaped into a nice tight circle with just a little circle in the center there, you want to take your hot glue gun and add hot glue to the center of that circle. Then you're going to want to hold it pinched shut until that hot glue begins to harden. Once the hot glue has hardened onto your backing, you want to add probably something to the center so that you can get a finished look. I'm going to use my uh, Triple Blossom Punch with some Sahara Sand cardstock. I'll take the little flower. If your glue is still hot, you can just glue it on with that. If not, just Pop it on a mini glue dot. You could also use scallops look nice, uh, whatever you want to decorate your center. And I want to go just one step further with that and I'm going to add a designer button. Push that on my mini glue dot and add my designer button. I have a lolly ready to add to my project. 
All that's left is to add your medallion to your project. And today I made a birthday card using the Perfectly Pen um, stamp set. And I stamped that in Always Artichoke. And my Hello Dolly background stamp stamped the doily. And we'll just add our medallion to the center of that. And we have a real pretty, almost 3D looking card. Thanks for stopping at Stamping Country.